Hey guys, what's up? My name is Judson Hook. Today I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit about some situations and stuff like that, but I don't know what I'm going to go with. Uh, but I wanted to show y'all something that happened to me a while back. Uh, I remember I was probably like, man, how old do you think I was, man? I was probably like eight years old, all right? Now, I've seen a lot of videos resurface late, lately about uh, people making these tinfoil balls. Uh, I'll tell you right now, them tinfoil balls, they're pretty awesome. Back then, man, I made a tinfoil ball, all right? A tinfoil ball that I made, it was a... Uh, I had every one of my dad's friends that smoked collect their uh, foil. And, man, I'd get just, like, stacks and stacks of this, like, tinfoil... I don't even know if you can get the same kind of foil nowadays. You used to be able to peel it right off. No problems whatsoever. You'd just be able to peel it right off and you'd have this real thin chunk of uh, tin foil. But, uh, man, I don't know how many packs of smokes this must have been. Oh, man, thousands of smokes, man. Oh, man, I don't know how many smoke packs he went through to get me this. But this here right here, check it out. I made that. Everybody crying right now. I don't know why. But, uh, whoa, even it, it's got a happy face. You see that? The reflection? It's a happy face there. But look at the shine of that. I'm going to try to get that to focus right on the ball. Oh, right in front of my face here. But, uh, look at that. That took some time and some polishing. But I'll tell you what, the layers of that is probably like, man. The amount of packs of smokes that somebody had to smoke to get me these tin foil pieces, like, that's a solid aluminum ball, man. And I made that. And I made that. As you can see, like, there are some, like, discrepancies here, like, right there. You can see that, uh, that where the tin foil had come off there or whatever from that layer. But, uh, man, just like, you know, I just kept going, wrapping, 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 wrapping. And then I took the time to, uh, I found a nice, uh, sheet of metal that I would, that a harder piece that I would, that would roll it, kind of polish it, right? So I kind of polished around the edges and made it nice and shiny, but, you know, keeping it nice and round, and, and that's a solid chunk of aluminum, man. That's pretty awesome. I mean, that's some, uh, I wonder if you can buy thin slices. Like, you can't use regular tin foil because, well, you probably could, but there's probably other ways to deal with it, but, uh, other than that, like, that that's a pretty cool, uh, thing to do. I did that. But, uh, you know how that goes. But until next time, you know how that goes. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys that tinfoil ball that I made a while back. And, uh, yep, that's pretty nice. I'd, I'd suggest doing that if you had, uh, you know, if you had the, uh, the amount of tinfoil that I did back in the 90s, man. That's a lot of stuff. A lot of cigarettes to be smoked. You know what I mean? Anyways. Kind of cool little thing I did back in the day. Thought maybe all y'all wanted to see it. That's pretty cool. Uh, Alright. Well, thanks for watching. If you like the video, don't be afraid to subscribe, like the video, do whatever you want, man. It's your choice. I uh, No pressure, dog. You don't even have to like it. I don't care. No pressure. Alright. Thanks for watching.